what's up guys Imano here in this video i want to show you how you can create a paystack account so that you can sell your product anywhere in the world and receive your payment from right here in nigeria so if you want to sell digital product or probably physical product then paystack will help you collect payments for those products without stress and then send you your payment to your nera account so if you have an online course you want to sell or you have an ebook or you are into e-commerce whatever it is that requires you to sell online and then you want to get your payment paystack will help you achieve that so one very awesome feature that paystack introduced recently is the fact that you can now sell your digital product with storefront and product links what this means is you can actually host your ebook or your online course before now you probably use um, Google Drive upload your videos your course videos on Google Drive then use paystack to set up the payment page then when people pay they get redirected to Google Drive where they get to access the course but right now you can actually upload your course videos to paystack so that people can pay through paystack and then get access to this course on paystack and again one very interesting thing you want to know about paystack is it's free you only pay when customers pay right so they charge you a certain fee if i come over to pricing here you see that they charge you 1.5 percent plus 100 naira when people pay from nigeria okay so 100 naira fee waived from transactions on that 2500 naira so that means if you are selling products that are less than 2500 naira this 100 naira fee will not apply okay so and it's for local transactions that transactions in nigeria okay but if you are receiving payment internationally you get to pay a charge of 3.9 percent plus 100 naira fee so get paid by your customers from all over the world international cards are charged and settled in naira by default but you can also choose to get settled in us dollars okay so you can receive your payment in us dollars from paystack now what pushed me to paystack actually is because i wanted to sell my product in some countries usually i would use seller but some countries are actually not familiar with the payment gateway on seller for instance when i tried ghana people in ghana prefer paying for my courses through paystack than through seller so that's what really pushed me to uh, paystack and they have been working very very fine so as you can see here modern online and offline payments for africa paystack help businesses in africa get paid by anyone anywhere in the world so you can sell your products to anywhere and you can also integrate paystack to your website okay so if maybe you have a wordpress website you can just integrate paystack so that people can pay through paystack and then you get the money where they get the product you are selling so simple easy payment and all those stuff. so you can just read through all of this and see everything that paystack is going to offer you and your business so if you have product to sell or you want to start selling your product to any country in the world but how to receive this payment is a big issue for you then paystack is the solution you need so as you can see these companies all use paystack airpiece females piggyverse ebomb air kuda and all these people here as you can see even banking platforms use paystack so if you need a payment service provider that will help you collect payments internationally and locally paystack is definitely one you should consider so to create a paystack account all you just need to do is to come over here and click create a free account as you can see your country is automatically selected i'm in nigeria so nigeria here but you can also open paystack account in ghana south africa so country i'm selecting my country which is nigeria then here you want to enter your business name your first name your last name your email address okay now because you are going to have to submit your document for verification you must ensure that the names you are entering here should correspond to the names you have on your ids okay because they are going to ask for it before your account is going to get verified you enter your email address you enter your phone number and then you enter your password okay so here you want to choose the type of business you own if your business is registered you have a cac registration certificate then you select registered business right but if your business is not registered then what you want to do is select starter business and they'll ask you are you a software developer you answer appropriately so if you are not a software developer just pick no and then click i consent to the collection and all of your policies then you click on create my account 
so i'm going to fill in this form now then we continue now the next thing you need to do is to verify your email address so you just check your email for the verification link sent to you so i'm going to my email now to do the verification so this is what the email you are going to receive will look like thanks for signing up paystack before you get started accepting payments paystack we need you to confirm your email address please click on all of that so i'm just going to click this confirm email address after confirming your email address the next thing you just need to do is to log into your account so just use your email and the password you created in the previous form to sign into your paystack account where we'll proceed with the verification process so i'm just going to log in this is what your newly created paystack accounts will look like so welcome your business is in test mode so what this means is you can create test payment pages and test all of these functions you have on paystack here but for you to start receiving live payment you have to submit the required document okay so just click on got it and here you just want to fill in all of the details in the description box you want to describe what your business is all about so you have to be very detailed about your description because you want to explain what you do in your business okay so that's one of the main factors paystack will review before approving your account so you want to enter the number of people working in your business if it's just only you choose one to five if you have more than five people working in your business you choose five to fifty to choose the appropriate number enter the industry see there are a lot of industries you can pick from agriculture commerce education financial services gaming hospitality health leisure and all of that so just enter the appropriate industry um, that your business is located then you select the category so you see the subcategories you can choose so let me see other educational services so business type is starter business if your business is not registered with the cac right so here i'm just going to enter a very short description so i'll just enter sales of online courses okay so you need to be as detailed as possible with your description now after you have filled in all of this the next thing you just want to do is to click on save so as you can see here your account your paystack account is in test mode and here you have a notification here that says please enable two-factor authentication on your account to improve security okay so you just come over to account here profile and do that okay so now on this page the next thing you want to do is to click on next here just summary of everything you filled in the previous page click on next so here you enter email address that's your general email address then you enter the email you want people to contact you with as customers to contact you with if you want to use the same email address with the one above you choose use general email the email you want to direct dispute to so if people have payment issues delivery issues and all of that where are they going to send their complaints so enter the email or if you want to use the same email with your general email you check use the same email here you just want to enter your phone number and then here you enter a website if you have a website then you can link your social media platforms to your account okay so if you don't have a website you can leave this blank it's not compulsory now the next thing you have to enter is your office address okay so where is your office located so let me say nigeria for instance just enter all of these details you select the region let me enter lagos then the city i'm just going to use lagos still here you enter your street address and your apartment's address so let me say number one so i'm just creating a test account that's why i'm entering all these details but you enter um the correct details for your office address then you click on save then you click on next and then what you just want to do is to enter your id details your first name last name as it is on your id your date of birth nationality the id document you are using and then the id number okay so this is what you just want to fill in here so i'm just going to do that off the camera then the next thing you have to fill down here is your home address if it's the same as your business address you check this button if it's not the same you uncheck and then enter the address all right so proof of address here you can submit a utility bill bank statement showing current showing your address tax assessment form cable tv um, receipt later from a public authority maybe an affidavit or whatever it is you just want to submit a proof of address right so just take a picture of the one you have and submit and then the next thing you just want to come over here to do is to click save so you see all of these details here you click next and then enter your bank account 
and this is where your payout will be going to so just select your bank enter your account number then you enter your bank name okay so i'll just do that and then what you want to do next is to click on save now with all of those details filled in the next thing you just want to do is to click on activate business so here we are reviewing your business activation request please expect feedback at your admin's email address within 24 hours so they are going to review all the details you just submitted and then approve your account if you submitted the right details okay then here you can come to profile you can just turn on two-factor authentication here if you want to but i'm not going to do that right now i just created this account to show you guys the process then if you come over to your paystack home and you can see all the data you have here right now everything here is zero but by the time you start receiving payment you are going to see all your numbers you see your customers you see the refunds you have to make or you've made see the payout you've gotten right you can create recurring payment plans for people probably for people to subscribe to your email list or to subscribe to a membership community and all of that then you can create payment pages you can add product here storefront if you want to create an online course with paystack you use this storefront option okay so what you just need to do is you click on create new storefront and then you enter the details so let me say digital marketing course the currency set it at nera then this is the shop link now you click create now remember everything you'll be doing at this point is just a test till paystack approves your account so what you just want to do is you click on add new product and then add your product and do follow just follow the simple prompts that you have and you are going to create probably your online course or whatever it is you want to sell using paystack also by the time your paystack account gets approved you are going to get the api keys and the web hooks you can use to integrate paystack to your website okay and in case you are not the one developing your website you just need to send the keys to your developers and they'll help you do the integration to get that come over to your account here come over to profile and then come over to api keys and webhooks and then you have this um, test secret key test public keys and all those stuff that you can use to add paystack to your website so guys this is how you create a paystack account and use it to collect payments from anywhere in the world if you sell online from nigeria i hope this video helps you and before you go i want you to smash the like button give this video a like and if this is your first time of coming to my youtube channel my name is manuel and on this channel i create helpful videos about online business and videos that help you make money online and what you need to do right now before you leave this video is to hit the subscribe button subscribe to the channel thank you guys for watching i'll see you in the next video